Hi guys, a few things I want to talk to you about before we get into this Harrison's Island video, which is awesome. Make sure you watch it all the way through. Some cool things happen there throughout that video. Um, I got a couple slow motion catches and stuff like that in there, and you can see how I set my rod and all that stuff. But anyways, uh, before we get into that video, I want to talk to you guys about these rocket bobbers. A lot of people wait for that rocket bobber to tip up like this, right? To get a, When you get a bite on a rocket bobber, they usually just tip up. Sometimes they'll tip straight up, and then they'll go down. Most of the time, they're just tipping it, and that fish is on there, okay? So remember that. If you don't know, remember that. If, that, if it's sitting in the water like this, and it goes like this, there's a fish on there. Reel until your bobber stands up, and then set the hook. Don't just yank, because you got all that slack in the line, right? So as this bobber comes up, reel until that bobber lifts. Reel very slow, and when it lifts, then just put the pressure on it. You'll see it in that video. Another thing I want to talk to you guys about, though, is that negative bite you've heard me mention it many times and it's a real thing okay so say there's a little bit of ripples in the water and your bobber's kind of going through the ripples it's doing this a little bit right up and down just like that and all of a sudden it turns okay and go and just it's a different direction reel down on that and usually it'll stand up there's a fish on there or you're running a little too deep and you might have a weed just raise it raise your jig up a little bit typically two to four feet below the bobber and and you'll you'll be fine uh, but then negative bites a lot of times that's one thing they'll do another thing they'll do is that bobber will be going along like this And all of a sudden it'll just stop and it, you won't get a raise out of it. It'll just stop That's also a negative bite another thing your bobber will be going this way and All of a sudden it turns around and it starts going this way and I hear a lot of people say the current changed No, there's a fish on there. So That negative bite you got to pay very close attention to it because a lot of the times it'll be something just like this your bobber will be sitting there in the, in, the, in the little ripples if it's ripply over there, which a lot of times it is. And all of a sudden it'll just turn a little bit. Okay? That don't just happen. It's not going to sit here and do this stuff in the water. It's not. It's going to float right along. It's weighted. So it's going to float right along. And as soon as that bobber makes a turn, or as soon as that bobber lifts up kind of on that and goes down, real slow until that bobber lifts fully, and then reel down enough set that hook another another negative bite is if it's say it's flat calm and you're sitting there and you're watching your bobber set out there just kind of sit there and move back and forth a little bit and all of a sudden it just does something different just like this or just like this or even like this and then turn that's all negative bites okay so when they what that negative bite is when they're grabbing your line they're slacking it and as soon as that bobber catches up, it's doing something. Whichever way that fish has turned his mouth, it's got it in his mouth. So whichever way he's facing, say he's facing this way, he grabs it. And he's got it in his mouth. And your bobber's wanting to kind of move along. And all of a sudden, it just kind of stops and goes this way. That fish is just swimming slowly with it. So reel down and just lift up. But anyways, I hope you guys liked this video. Another good day on Harrison's Island. I'm getting over the sickness, so I'll be back over there soon. I'll also be up in Lexington catching those steelhead. Uh, maybe up there and and uh, behind Alexander's Bait and Tackle and Seed Wing for perch and crappies. But anyways, watch for a lot of those negative bites are going to be your crappies, okay? Or they're going to be giant gills. The negative bites are usually big fish. So they're smart. They know what to do. They've outdid thousands of people fishing this year already, right? So they've had hooks to their mouths. They've seen it all. So just pay close attention to those negative bites. Hope you guys enjoy this video. Also, a huge thank to my sponsors listed behind me here. If you guys have not checked them out, go give them a like on Facebook and Instagram. We got John Latham Customer Apollos, Thumpham Soft Plastics, Scales Fish Attractant, DJ's Tackle, I Yo Yo, Runkle, Catch the Fever Outdoors, Razor Rods, Bootleg Coolers, Triple Threat Lures, Jay's Marine Hardware, Dead End Tackle, High C, Camo Jojo, Hunt Chef, Best Seasonings They Make, Period. Shantytown Jigs, Undertow Tungstens, Goodfellas Catering and Barbecue, Arctic Spinners, Buck Scent Pads, Higher Quality Small Engine Repair, Banger Hand Tied Jigs, and the Rooster Ranch. Make sure you guys go give all those pages a like and follow, and trust me, you guys will enjoy that, and I got discount codes for everybody, so send me a message or whatever, and I'll get you the code. Be sure to check out my sponsors listed above. Check them guys out. Give them a like and follow on Facebook and Instagram.
got Al, we got Brett, we got Trevor, and yours truly, we're heading to the island. To beat the thing thumb from the guys. They got a contest going for the big, they got a contest going for the big kill. That right there itself made us want to go to the island just to get the biggest kill. But uh there's a whole crew of people over there right now. No, a YouTube video did not start this. Go look at the island right now. I heard it's packed from pretty much the ferry all the way down. So don't go blame the YouTube channel. Anyways, we'll see you guys on the island. Here we go, getting on the ferry, as you can see. But yep, YouTube did this. YouTube did all this. We just caught the Town Ferry. <laughs> We were on the ferry to go across, look at fishing poles loaded up in their car, but that's our fault. YouTubers, YouTubers did this. YouTubers did this to the island. They, they wronged us. And right, right down there at the surgeon hole, right down there at that blue dock down there, I ain't gonna say much about it, but that's where we get a lot of sturgeon. A lot of sturgeon, there's sturgeon right here. Sturgeon right here. Stomp them. Look at this place. Oh, it's a zoo. Yep, it's a zoo, but blame it on the YouTubers. There's Rob. Look it up here. There goes Josh. There's Pat Allen. Oh, oh. Look at this. Oh my goodness. Here goes a little guy right here. There he goes. And Brent's got one going. Looks like a keeper. Yep, nice. Brent's hooked up. Travis, Travis lost him. Al hooked up on a good one. Brent's hooked up. I got a bite. I got one hooked up. There's Brent. Here comes mine. And mine's a lot goer. I would. I shortened mine up. Got one on here, fellas. Don't feel very big. You never know, though. He will keep. But I'm gonna let him go today. Haha. <laughs> Travis is hooked. Got himself a gill. Brent's hooked up over there. Tank. Nice one. And he lost it. Just like that. There's a bite right here on mine. There's a bite right here on the rocket bobber keeps tipping. Let's go off. I'll play with you. Let's go. Let's go up here. Sounds like a good one. It is. A nice one. Heck yeah. Nice fish. Wow, he took that under from way down in there. Good 
got some weeds. Pulled out the structure with them. Short. That went short. Right now. There's a bite. 
Got him. Feels a little. Feels real little. Those are fun fish to fight though. Fun fish to fight. Gail's down there getting a few. Brett and Travis are getting a few. I'm getting some fish. We're doing good. This place is absolutely packed, so we decided to come way down where nobody else was at. Mm -hmm. We're catching fish, you know. So, you ain't got to be where they're at. You got to be where the fish is at. And that's not where everybody's at at all, all the time, you know. And these guys going to catch fish set in here. Here, Austin, I want you to open this. Check that out. Heck yeah, man, them are nice. I'm saying you can play around with it. They, they ain't that bad. That's awesome, man. And uh, as long as you give me a day in advance, Staples prints them out. Okay. So as long as you got 24 hour notice, Staples prints them out. Yeah, you see what you got? Didn't do that. Here, I'll hold the bag for you. Pull it out. Look, 
on the other side. Oh, yeah, son. <laughs> I'm gonna put this on. And got, look at this. It's got a look at this sleeve. Look. Oh, and it's a bass. Yeah. And it's got the QR code on that sleeve. <laughs> yeah, that might be why. But that all glows in the dark too. Dude, look at you out here in the gear. Heck yeah, man. Look at you out here in the gear, bro. Heck yeah. Thank you, man. <laughs> no hey, problem. Man. Thank you. Oh yeah, no problem. Like you like it, buddy? Yeah. Like I said, I. Don't